Hello there and welcome back again to Copycat Lemming. So we're up to Mayhem 21 now, which is the counting on you. 30 lemmings, we can lose three of them, and we've got three entrances here and two exits. Not sure how relevant the two exits is gonna be, but wait, how many will we lose? Okay, we can lose three lemmings on this one. And I don't think this looks like it's going to be too hard of a level, to be honest. This guy up here. Locker here. Okay, so that solves the top two groups with two lemmings lost. And that does not do anything noteworthy for these guys. That's better. Huh? Oh, you fucking what, mate? It's just a matter of having to position this bomber a bit better, I hope. No, now it was too far to that side, okay. Ideally you want to get that bomber just right in the middle on that. I like the way how these two come together with perfect timing like that. Let's see, has that worked out there? Yes! Okay, so yeah. We get back to solving this group now, which will require the bomber to be placed... Ah, uh, not bomber, builder to be placed a bit better than I did that first time. With a bit of luck, I should not need the blocker. No, I'm going to need the blocker. Ooh, is that going to... No, that works out well. Okay, so that's that level done. Okay, nice level there. Definitely feeling the difficulty now. So level 22, the long man. So we can lose 10 lemmings on this one. What do we have to do it with? Uh, a fair bit of stuff. This one is. Oh, okay, I didn't realise we had a. Wait. Huh, ah, there's. Isn't that meant to be there or is that a glitch? No, it would seem that that's meant to be there. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, that guy's gonna have to be our. Oh, the our climber so okay so there I should be able to step up there. yep so here on out it's just a matter of placing the bash as well which we may only need two of the first one we get these two groups together. And is that gonna work out? Uh, not quite, but too low. Never mind, that should fix up that. Yep, there we go. 99 it. And there, okay, that was another neat level. 
on to level 23 now. He's lost and gone again, so we can lose two lemmings on this one. We've got another multiple entrances set up. Ooh, and we're a bit limited on the skills here. Okay, let's have a look around. Okay, yeah, so that's survival. Oh, we've got a trap here by the looks of things. But it's a very avoidable trap. Yeah, that didn't work out as well as I'd hoped over this side. Okay, so we can probably 99 this now. Okay, and they're all combining into one tidy group there, and we will be able to just bash out. And there we go. Okay, okay, I like that level. It's short, it's simple in terms of not complex, but not easy. So that was a good level. On to level 24, which is Back and Forth. Didn't we already have a level titled Back and Forth? No, I'm thinking of a level that Giga made. Okay, um, so this level, we can't lose any lemmings, and we have a release rate of 97. Okay. Hmm. Well, that solves that first part of it. Um, okay, now what do we have to do? Okay, so we've got to get up here. And we've got one builder to work with. Hmm. And we can't lose any lemmings. Ooh, this is going to be a challenge. Unless we just go under. Which I think can be done. digging one vertical pixel earlier. Maybe more than one. There we go. That was a pretty neat puzzle. Okay, so on to level 25, Opposable Lemming. Ah, okay, so this one I have solved fairly recently, and this level is a lot harder under Neo Lemmings than it was under the original Lemmings. I don't remember the solution offhand as such, but let's see if I can work it out again. Let him come back, he can seal this off. Okay, so now I need to build up here.
pretty much build into here and position things completely right especially with a bomber that we're going to have to use soon to break through fully There we go, okay. There we go, okay, so yeah. In original copycat lemmings, it's a lot easier to build up into those stacks on the right because the builder terrain checks aren't as strict. But Neo Lemmix is not so forgiving on that, so. Yeah, okay, so level 26. It's fun if you know the angles, so we can lose four lemmings here. And uh, this does not look like it's going to be much fun. You can see where we lose our four lemmings. Blockers. we're doing here is a continuous mine all the way through so it's a fairly common lemmings trick okay so I've got the first part of it right mostly thanks to Chipo allowing lemmings to walk up that which is one of the Chipo mechanics that Neo Lemix does replicate there's not many of them that it replicates intentionally but that's one of them and yeah, so it looks like that was, if not the solution, at least a viable solution. So we're on to level 27 now. Push Adam Space Grill. So we've got to save every lemming and it does not look like it's going to be too easy to do so. Oh. I'm not expecting them to both come out facing to the right, in all honesty. <laughs> you what, mate? I don't think we can get back up there with just two builders, so I think we need to revise this one a bit. Maybe not start this build so close to the edge. But we also have to not let the blocker turn the builder around, so... This will conserve one builder. I think we'll be able to get up there. Error, not good. Okay, so this way we've got Now, how do we want to go about trying to get them back up here? Hmm. Here we go. 
you two builders should get the height, but we'll deal with sorting out the various turnarounds. So let's start with getting them out of here. Up to there. And that's not gonna do much. Aha! Okay, I think I see how to do this one. Completely overlooked the non main looking area of the level. Now I think I see what to do. Ah uh, yes, this pretty much looks like it's perfectly set up for this to work, so I'd be very, very surprised if this wasn't intended, to be honest. Okay, um, what can I do about that? I pretty much need every skill I've still got. Okay. I know what I can do about it. Okay, that was a brilliant level. Totally love that one. That, that is an awesome level. So what's level 28 got in store for us? Best be done while smashed. We can lose three lemmings on this one. Rue bear, not root bear, rue bear. Mm, okay. And... Okay, I don't think this one's going to be very hard. And how many can we lose? Three lemmings, okay. Highlight in there, I just wanted to make him do a skill. Is that going to be still survivable? Let's pull down the scrubs so that we've only got one. Oh, I did not think of that. Um, okay. We can do without this thing. Okay, I know what we can do about it. So we'll block up here instead. Patch over this little gap. Get all the lemmings out. Blamitar or something. And this should do it. We can get rid of this guy now. 
There we go. Okay, okay. That's pretty neat level 2. So level 29, off to the 119th exit. So this is a somewhat trapified repeat of one of the taxing, was it, levels? Or tricky? We can lose two lemmings here. We don't have bloaters, but... As you may notice, we do have a non steel bit up here, so that's what we'll be taking advantage of to get to this exit. To exit number 119. drop them down there to fall straight into the traps, though, which we don't want. Mine down from here. Now here's the question, can we build over it? I don't think we can. Yes we can! But it would appear we are one builder short of being able to get everyone back past it in this direction. Okay, so let's start this again. And do that. Saves us a Builder. Which means that we should be able to make this work out. And yeah, all falls together perfectly. Alright. And done it with a minor left to spare. Okay, nice level this one. These last few levels are definitely very good. So, on to level 30, which is a sort of repeat of the very first level. Okay, but let's see what this has to offer. Yeah, for some reason the screen starts up there. I'm not sure why that's happening. Um, so... 99 bombers, but we need to save every lemming, so they're pretty useless bombers. However, there's a gap in the one ways up here, which I'm assuming is what we're meant to be making use of to get the lemmings home. Okay. Oh, and how convenient, the one ways pushed us up a little bit there. And from there it's just a straight build to the exit. A bit of a easy final level there, but then the ones leading up to it were hard. And I mean, when I do my packs, that's how I do it as well. I don't really put a overly hard level as the final one. I mean, I suppose Lemmings Plus 3 could be considered a special case. I mean, the final level isn't the hardest, but it is a fairly hard one. But... Yeah, so anyway, I, that's the end of Copycat Lemmings, and I have to say, um, it's the first time I've properly, completely played through Copycat Lemmings, even though I first discovered it, heck, would have been about 15 years ago. Obviously back then it was on a genuine copy of it, not on Neo Lemmix, but, I mean, for the most part it works out the same, but, yeah, okay. I have to say, it's a, definitely a good level pack, so... Hope you've enjoyed this. I'll be thinking about what level pack to do next. Um, 
I don't know, if nothing new comes out, maybe I'll do one of the Sea Lemmings level packs, but till then, have a good one, and I'll see you next time. I am still going to be doing my Lemmings Plus videos, by the way, so we're going to be starting on Lemmings Plus 3 shortly for that one. So, yeah, keep tuned in, and I'll see you when I see you.